my channel jeevan kudipati so in this video i am going to unbox the new galaxy m31s which i got for my personal use so this is just an unboxing video where i am going to unbox the retail box of the galaxy m31s so there is another video i am going to take out on in which i am going to share my review on this phone but let gets into this video where i am going to show all the specifications of this phone so this is the new galaxy m31s which is a 6GB RAM 128GB variant which I got there is also another variant which is 8GB and 128GB so first let's get into the box on the first look we have the phone and then we also get a SIM ejector tool and a 25W super fast charger included in the box what's the specialty of this charger is we get a 25W super fast charger which we also see in the Galaxy S series and also in the Note 10 series and we get a Type 2 to type c to type c cable included in the box so we don't get a usb to type c we get a type c to type c box included into the box so let's take a look onto the handset itself where we get a punch hole camera on the front and when it comes to the back we have four cameras one is a 64 megapixel IntelliCam the other one is ultra wide camera and also the other one is a depth camera and we also get a micro camera included in it on the bottom we get a 3.5 mm jack a USB type C and also a single speaker When it comes to the side, we get a fingerprint on the side and also volume buttons. And on the top, we also get a secondary microphone and the other side, we get a SIM, SIM insertion tool where we get uh, both dual nano SIMs as well as a external SD card. We can put all of them together. And when it comes to the build quality, I did like the build quality of the phone and the Phone comes with a plastic body on the back. It doesn't get a glass body, but the finishing of the plastic body is very good. So let's take a dive into the phone. I have already set the phone for my personal use and right now it's running on One UI 2.0 and version 10. And when it comes to the security patch level, recently I got an update of September, but when I was making the video, I got a security patch level of July. So that's all for today guys. Let me check the audio quality and the screen resolution of the phone using a sample video which I have in my phone. So the screen does look crisp and uh, great and the sound quality is also very good. <laughs> 